Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to review for you cordless circular saw from Parkside, the special line of Parkside, Parkside Performance. So it's uh, intended uses for professionalists, not for DIY uh, users. Therefore we can expect a higher quality and uh, uh, on the beginning I will share with you my uh, quick judgment which is rather negative and if you want to know why stay uh, to the end of the uh, video so what you are paying for it's a brushless motor uh, for long uh, lifespan due to l low wear and tear uh, it has a, of course on off switch with quick stop uh, it has a adjustable cutting depth and cutting angle which is a standard for such uh, devices it is also uh, it has also a nice feature with a LED work light which is nice to have it but it's not a, it is not a necessity you've got uh, together in the package a special charger uh, <coughs> which is designed for this uh, high performance or better to say with a higher capacity batteries but and now we are getting into what's wrong in my opinion with that particular example mm, this battery is dead i was trying to test it i was trying to charge it but i was i have failed uh, this battery is 20 uh, 20 volts and uh, capacity is uh, 5 ampere hours so it's uh, i would say uh, decent for such uh, a device, I would recommend to have uh, two at least uh, batteries to, to be able to work in the long run. But one is still enough, if uh, especially if you take into consideration that uh, this charger is uh, charging or should uh, charge uh, uh, this battery approximately in 90 minutes. Uh, what I'm showing right now it's a red mm, label because uh, sometimes ago especially in in phones uh, such labels after uh, getting water was uh, or it was indication uh, if any of devices has been flooded so I don't know if that's the case with this um, particular um, tool but the fact is that it's not working at all so I was not able to to test it properly uh, what you have um, mm, I mean in terms of features what you are what you should have if this is of course if it is running no load speed is 4500 um, uh, uh, rotations per minute uh, so blade diameter it's uh, uh, 190 millimeters and that's I think is one of the crucial uh, parameters Arbor diamond 20 uh, millil uh, millimeters, maximum cutting depth at the 90 uh, uh, angle degrees, it's um, 62 millimeters, at angle of 45 degrees, it's a 45 uh, millimeters. Uh, together with this set, with this device, you've got uh, 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 keys just to screw and unscrew for instance uh, mm, mm, saw blade and uh, it has been in my opinion well designed because there is a storage for that and it's very decently uh, put it on the side uh, in in general the, the the whole quality how it's how it is made uh, it's it's good it's decent but please take into consideration uh, once again I was not able to test it properly because battery is dead and on the end of the video I will also show you the production date but uh, now I will, I will just try to um, charge it uh, at least for a while just to show you that um, this, this uh, battery doesn't work and in my opinion it's unacceptable that uh, this uh, or such product is uh, put it on sales and uh, please also take into consideration that uh, production date 
uh, of this device is 2017 and now we have a 2019 so at least um, two years this saw was um, at the warehouse I don't know where and now it has been put it on sales I don't know if this is um, part of some kind of refurbishing process or um, after warranty after market sales don't know I cannot see any uh, sign of usage on the um, on this on this saw so in my opinion it's brand new but from unknown reason this um, this this uh, this battery is doesn't work so in my opinion it's uh, even uh, the biggest uh, even bigger disadvantage because if the um, uh, lithium ion battery decay after let's say two years doesn't sound good in terms of uh, quality in the long run of course usually mm, batteries are mm, put it out of the warranty or at least after usually after six months they are out of the warranty so I can accept that but I c what I cannot accept is that the battery doesn't work at all with a so-called brand new mm, saw uh, okay in terms of other uh, parameters for this uh, uh, device uh, it would be nice to have uh, some kind of accessories in terms I mean mm, this the saw but mm, because it's a uh, for pros I could imagine that uh, uh, they should have their own but mm, what is I mean for pros very important it's a uh, uh, sound pressure level uh, it's uh, uh, there are two parameters uh, sound pressure level LPA 89 decibels and sound power level LWA which is 100 decibels I'm a little bit confused because uh, I thought it will be uh, the, the the noise have uh, or should have uh, one particular um, parameter and 100 decibels is already a lot and uh, the, tel the tolerance in both of those it's um, 3 decibels so plus minus 3 but uh, still I'm not so sure uh, which is what so if somebody knows what is the uh, practical difference between LPA and LWA please share with me uh, it will be good to to have it mm. also the, the vibration which is uh, uh, for pros very important because they are working with the uh, with this device um, uh, in long run it's a hand arm vibration uh, free dot 65 meters per s2 sorry I don't know this value and uh, by the way uh, just take a closer look 2017 as I mentioned before after two years they have put it on sales uh, and coming back to this vibration the second hand arm vibration it's a uh, 2.97 also please if somebody knows uh, what does it mean in from the practical point of view please share with me okay it was charged three four minutes in terms of the uh, maximum operation time uh, of uh, 90 minutes it, it's a few percentage so at least it should be something uh, only I can see the LED light is flashing but there is a no move whatsoever the battery and really believe me I was trying to uh, test it trying to charge it before uh, for a while and still I couldn't uh, generate any uh, power out, out, out of this um, battery so only LED light is, is flashing uh, there is a sensor uh, on the battery that is showing that there is a red dot so this battery is dead and uh, I'm disappointed so therefore I'm, I'm saying that um, this uh, test uh, or, or my impression my judgment is negative because I couldn't test it whatsoever uh, and in my opinion it's unacceptable that uh, such product is uh, uh, put it on sales and as well together with uh, other types I had a similar exp experience uh, so thank you for watching stay tuned and see you next time bye